My name is Monica Hernandez, and I am a doctoral student of the program Training in the Knowledge Society of Salamanca University. I am thrilled to share with you my PhD project, Proposal of a Multivariate Analysis Model to Evaluate the Learning Outcomes of Students in Higher Education. In recent years, the academic community's focus to improve the quality of educational processes in higher education has increased. The accreditation agencies usually demand proof of the fulfillment of their learning outcomes because this provides an excellent input to evaluate the effectiveness of educational systems. However, there are some challenges. First, few institutions have developed effective methods to evaluate learning outcomes, and in most cases, this kind of evidence is collected manually. Second, many higher education institutions continue with a traditional educational approach. And in order to evaluate learning outcomes, institutions must adopt pedagogical models centered on the learner. Additionally, there are still theoretical gaps that explain which elements of the university curriculum are associated with academic programs' learning outcomes. The lack of empirical evidence keeps us away from 1. Identifying which factors are associated with an efficient achievement of learning outcomes in higher education institutions and second, implement improvement actions based on valid and objective data. In this context, learning analytics is a valuable tool that can support collecting, measuring, analyzing, and reporting data to understand the different factors involved in the educational process and their influence on learning. The scenario described leads to the need to identify the factors associated with learning outcomes in higher education institutions. It is important to emphasize that learning analytics within the framework of this study is a tool that will facilitate the collection and processing of information. The general objective of this research is to define and validate a multivariate meta model based on the factors that intervene in the achievement of learning outcomes and academic performance of graduates. The complexity of this study requires breaking down each objective into phases, activities, procedures, and instruments. This case study will be carried out at the Costa Rican Institute of Technology. The first objective is to identify how learning analytics has been implemented to measure the achievement of learning outcomes in higher education institutions. In order to respond to the first objective, we will carry out a systematic literature review. The second objective is to define a meta model for the identification of the predictive factors of learning outcomes in academic performance. For its achievement, we need to develop two activities. The first activity, we will create a standardized methodological guide for collecting learning outcomes uniformly in the institution by professors. The second activity, we will define the learning analytics method. Once done, computational professionals will develop the system functionalities with data collection of the learning analytics system. The third goal is to validate a multivariate model based on the predictive variables of learning outcomes and academic performance. In order to achieve this purpose, we will develop two activities. At first, we will develop a prototype study to validate the variables defined in the method. This prototype A study aims to carry out a preliminary review to assess the behavior of data, data and identify the predictive variables related to learning outcomes and academic performance. The results of this study will allow defining the model for, for its final validation. We will validate the meta model for the second activity. This validation will allow us to identify the predictive and correlated factors associated with learning outcomes and academic performance. Currently, the activities from the first and second stages are in development. We are writing a systematic review. In a parallel effort, we collect the information with the stakeholders for writing the methodology and we are validating it. Finally, we have had around six meetings for an initial phase 
to define the required survey for the learning analytics system. Thank you very much.